Well, 630 neglected cats from the Haven Acres Cat Sanctuary in High Springs are at least one step closer to a brighter future. TV 20's Chris Gilmore has more tonight on how volunteers are making the animals' transition a little easier. Some lice seen Okay, step back. Cages line the cramped walls of this warehouse as Patricia Rechnick works to nurse these cats back to health. It's by no means an easy job, but one that she enjoys. It's a passion, and once you start doing it, you keep coming back over and over again. It's like eating peanuts. You do it once, and you just can't stop. For the past two years, she and other volunteers have worked to save the cats that were on the verge of death. The cats are now under the ownership of the Humane Society of the United States and Delacho County Animal Services. The decision was reached after the previous owners of Haven Acres Cat Sanctuary, Steve and Penny Lefkowitz, legally handed over the animals Monday afternoon. The news is that they've been surrendered. Their custody has been relinquished, and now we can go to the next step. It's awesome. The next step is getting the cats ready to be adopted. After the cats are spayed or neutered and reach stable health, they'll be ready for adoption, which could be as soon as two weeks. Eventually, an adoption event will be held in hopes of reuniting the animals with their original owners or those looking to bring home a new pet. And we just, you know, hope that the public will come out when they're ready to be adopted and place a couple for us um, if they have some room in their homes and their hearts. But more than a home, these cats just need a little love. Chris Gilmore, TV20 News. Out of these 705 cats that were found at that sanctuary back in June, 70 so far have had to be euthanized.